Right, we turn to good health now, stress and emotional eating, commonly associated with weight gain and ultimately being overweight. Right, but what's actually going on inside the body? Does stress just make people hungrier or is it more complex than that? Dr. Frank McGeorge is here with a study that has a few of those answers. Exactly. Well, you know, it's probably no surprise. It is, in fact, a little bit more complicated. Mm -hmm. Studies have shown that stress does change the way our brain responds to comfort foods short term, but stress also produces long term hormone changes that by themselves have a link to obesity. A recent study shows a connection between the stress hormone cortisol and weight. People who had higher BMIs had higher levels of cortisol, and people who had higher waist circumference, kind of carrying their weight in the middle, also had that higher levels of cortisol. Researchers compared the stress levels and body weight of more than 2,500 men and women over the age of 54. They examined locks of hair for cortisol over a two-month period. Cortisol is a hormone that's secreted by the adrenal glands, and it tends to ramp up during times of stress. Back when humans had to run away from wild animals, increased cortisol was a useful mechanism. But today, stress is more chronic, and over time, it can wreak havoc on our bodies. The link between stress and weight gain is real. When people are artificially given cortisol, their caloric intake does increase. Stress also makes maintaining healthy habits, like getting a good night's rest, exercise, and eating a healthy diet much harder to keep up. This study is a good reminder for people to not let their health go to the back burner when they feel stressed out things like exercise, um, meditation, mindfulness exercises, relaxation. Those are ways that we can work towards good stress management, but also good weight management. Now, one thing that this study could not differentiate was if being overweight was a result of stress or if the stress experienced by the participants was the result of being overweight, and it's probably ultimately a combination yeah. of both. When you find yourself eating a lot of the wrong stuff, that causes stress, which means exactly. you eat more of the wrong stuff. Exactly. Yeah. But we know the cortisol and overweight definitely yeah. linked. Interesting. Okay. Right Thanks, Doc. Sure.